Hello everyone, Jerk Defiler here, and we are continuing on with a Patient Gamer Plays Slay the Spire. And we are doing the Act 1 run with the Watcher, our first playthrough with the Watcher. And she's pretty unique, pretty complex from the looks of it. Um, and again, this is a first impression, so we don't really know how she's going to be going forward. Um, so far, it seems like, alright, you know, kind of like, eh. Not really sure I care for the scry ability. It's just not my play style. But uh, that's me, you know. And the stances I can see being appealing, I think. I want, probably want to build something around that. But who knows? We'll have to see what cards we get. Okay, I got this. That's the new one I got last time. Uh, I need to move, I need more defense. I'm gonna take some damage this round. Let's see what that is. Is that wait, was that a power card? Or is it a skill? It's a skill card. And then I got insight. You ready then? I'm gonna take a hit this round. That's okay. It happens. Uh, what do we got here? Okay, that I definitely need. Draw two cards. What could I pull? Maybe I can pull another mantra. Because I am curious as to how... Nope, didn't get it. D up then. And I don't want to take any more damage, really. But I need to do some. So... Do I just want to take two damage? Yeah, it's great. There's there's two rest areas coming up. I can heal if I need to, which I probably won't need to because you know not really taking a lot of damage. And she seems to have a decent amount of block in her deck, so I'm sure I would be fine. All right, want to use that again? So yeah, I want to. I'm trying to check out to see what this divinity thing is. So once you get ten mantra, you enter divinity, and that sounds pretty cool. Um, do another defend so we don't take too much damage. Ugh, lovely allergies. And we got Montre again. Getting close. Uh, draw two cards. Yeah, why not? Maybe we can get another defend. I don't want to keep taking damage. That's how I always end up losing. So I just take little chips here and there and before I know it, I get to the boss and I'm completely screwed. Unless I get that relic that heals you for like 25 when you get to the boss. That thing's really nice. Alright. We can just hit, hit, and defend. One more way till Divinity. What is that? Prey, that's what it's called. So she's like a monk. I uh, can kill him with Wraith form? Yeah, I can kill him with Wraith form. I wanted to wait to see if I, I could get third eye. Or not third eye, Prey. Okay, there we go. Alright, so I am in Divinity. Upon entering the stance, gain three energy, attacks deal triple damage, X the stance at the end of your turn. So that's pretty cool. Ah! Alright, I mean that's easy enough. I'm sure they have a lot of mantra cards that can get you that. If you're in calm, draw three cards, otherwise intercom. Deal seven damage, scry two. Yeah, I'm not too sure about the scry thing. I don't know. I mean I'm sure it's you know, good. I just don't know how, like, I would want to use that. But, I mean, picking what goes out and gets discarded is nice and all, but... Eh, I, would I want to build a deck around that? I don't know. Tranquility or inner peace? Or inner peace, rather. I think inner peace, because I tend to be in calm a lot. I can heal or upgrade. I think we're going to upgrade can heal after the elite. I want to upgrade this. So gain four mantra, yeah. I like this card. I like the stance stuff. So that's kind of cool. Alright. What do we got? Oh, these guys are so annoying. It's probably my least favorite. 
Uh, well, at the end of your turn, if you are in calm, use that, might as well. And just be up, I guess, so really on the right option. Guess I could've used that, but whatever. It's all good, still just a learning experience. These guys are a pain in the ass, then negating and then days and days and days. One time, uh, I had so much that my entire like hand was just dazed. I got that's all I got from my deck. Still one though. They can't defeat me. All right, so I'm gonna be taking a lot of damage. Um, this always happens. I only take. I only um get defense when like they're not gonna attack. <laughs> when they are gonna attack, I get like all my attack damage ones. Okay, so let's just go after this guy because he's gonna be the one attacking next. Not that I can kill him next, I doubt it. Maybe if I do like a Wraith form play. But what are the odds of that? We don't know. And they have negate. Okay. Mantra. Pray. Uh, I can do 12 damage, but I wouldn't be able to get back into calm. So, I, mean, I guess I'll just take the defense until I can get things rolling. Not that I, like, I don't think I really have a deck that can get things rolling. It's pretty kind of turn by turn basis so far because it's so such a young deck um, oof it's a lot of days I'm gonna get wrecked here well at least I got some defense man this is gonna be either a super super long fight where I'm gonna end up with really low HP or I'm just gonna die really fast <laughs> uh, we'll see We'll see. If you are in calm, draw three cards. Sure, why not? Defend. Uh, man, when can I use this? Wouldn't be a good time to use that. I'm holding on to it, but I'm like, do I really need to? Until I start taking a lot of damage. Which I probably will soon because I am getting so much dazed that I'm just not doing any damage. Barely any of this guy. Well, got that. Ugh. This might be a very short run. <laughs> we'll see. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I don't think this is like my kind of style, this class, but we'll see. All right. Defend. Definitely don't want to go into Wraith form right now. Just slowly whittling these guys down there. Like once I get build the deck, maybe it'll be a lot, or not maybe for sure, it'll be a lot better, but Right now, I'm just not really seeing the appeal too much of the Watcher. Kind of, uh, I don't know, a little slow. But, again, it's the first playthrough, so can't really complain. Uh, do, do, do. All right, dazed. That's what I wanted. Well, gonna take more damage. Oh, jeez. Uh, come on. I'm not afraid to use. I don't have any debuffs, so those artifacts aren't much use to you guys. Where is my prey? I haven't seen that for a while. Did I use it already? I can? Oh, yeah, I guess I did. Okay. Well, uh, 
draw two cards. We're getting there. Save that for a strike. And this is all right. We're surviving, but once I get one of them down, then hopefully things will go a lot smoother. Uh, I'm getting too much dazed. Four damage. Could be worse. This is probably my least favorite elite fight. These guys are just annoying. Because this, this is what happens almost every time. It just takes forever for me to get them because they're so early on in the act. And then, um, I mean, just being in act one, rather. Well, that's going to give me 18 damage. I can at least kill that guy, but... Well, you know, that was very unsatisfying. <laughs> <laughs> only had 12 hit points left. Uh, that's okay. Bring it on. I'm not afraid of y'all. Alright, maybe I should D up a bit. At least I got like water. That's pretty helpful. Mm hmm. There's that dazed. Now we'll go after you. Really cool mechanics. She looks pretty neat. I like the art style there with like the ribbon just floating around her and you have like that aura of water or blizzard or snow or whatever it is. Zooming water. If you are in calm, draw three cards. Otherwise, da -da 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 -da. I can get prey. Well, at least I'm getting rid of some of those dazed. That's fine. You, uh, get rid of you. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a good, very good use for this. Don't know why I didn't see it earlier. D up, try to take as little damage as possible. I have no idea how I'm going to do on the boss with this girl. And again, this is a very unique elite fight, so it's kind of, uh, a bit uh, more difficult in my opinion than the other ones because it's just it takes just so long to get these guys down unless you have a really good build at the start well I don't have any attack so that's unfortunate yeah, if I get one more prey I can do divinity again hopefully I will actually have some good attack cards by good I mean the only attack cards <laughs> that I got so A A A Game fight but get rid of you Defend Leave me screw it I'm just gonna use this just hold it on to that for now Taking one more damage. Man, this is the longest fight on the planet. And I'm sure it's my own fault. But that's okay. At least I can do some damage here. I mean, I could use potions, but I don't really want to waste them just for, like, a, these little elites. I don't, I don't think so. I'd rather save these for a boss. So she has some pretty decent card draw, I'm noticing. I wonder what kind of mechanic she has to get her... Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, that was dumb. Because, like, I didn't have any attacks. Hey, there we go. Prime example of me not taking my time and reading rushing through stuff I should have held on till the next time I got that because I didn't have any attacks to actually benefit off of it
It's the slowest fight in the West. Do -do -do -do. But we're getting there, ladies and gentlemen. Bear with me. Yay. One more down. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Okay. Didn't do too bad. 49 HP left. It's not too shabby. Alright, get rid of that dazed. Good. More dazed. Get rid of dazed. Alright, got another strike. That's cool. Alright. So yeah, I'm, I'm interested in, in uh, seeing like once I can get some other mantra cards to build that. I bet that'll be a lot of fun. Getting more mantra, mantra cards and more attack cards. I think we can do some fun stuff with that. Alright, let's just do one of those, one of those, one of these. Who's that? Just went in there. Oh yeah, he's like... I forgot. Okay, and again, you never get the <laughs> strike cards when I, when I need them. Uh, use that, get rid of you, get rid of you. I thought that was supposed to go. Oh yeah, never mind. Well, at least he's not going to be able to kill me. Spray. I do like that like water ability. That's pretty cool. I wonder if how much it buffs it when I upgrade it. Finally, yay! I haven't seen this one before. Start each combat with one strength. Eh. I mean, all right. It's not that great. Deal nine damage. Wallop. Deal nine damage. Gain block equal to unblocked damage dealt. All right. So I can pretty much get um, nine block from that at max. Retain. Gain five block when retained. Increase its block by two this combat. Just like once. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, it would be by turn. Okay, so, I mean, that's not too shabby, right? You can get up to seven block. Seven block for, well... Eh, I mean, is that really that great? Because defend is five block, so it's just... It can just get up to seven, eh. I don't know. Whenever you scry, gain three block. That can be useful. Kind of seeing the benefit of the scry now. Alright, let's just rest up here. Then um, we'll hit the treasure room. Then we'll end it here. Blood vial. The start of each combat. Heal 2 HP. That's nice. That I like. Alright, we'll call it quits here. We're going to go this route. I think next time hit this elite. Heal up probably. And yeah, see how that goes. Alright. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. That was a super slow fight. But whatever. It happens. Take it easy. Thanks for watching. You guys have a good morning, afternoon, evening, and night, depending on where you are. Be sure to share, subscribe, and like the video if you want. It really helps. Just saying. New YouTuber here, you know, breakdown. Game on.